Bill will place the Virgin Queen in the tube so her abdomen sticks out. He will flow carbon dioxide up the tube to put her out. Then, after she is sufficiently subdued, he will grab a stinger with the forceps and together with the hook, expose her vaginal orifice. That's the syringe with the semen on the left, the forceps coming down top center, and the hook coming up from the lower right. Bill starts as soon as the queen is subdued enough to begin to minimize the time the queen is subjected to the gas. Bill grasps the stinger with the forceps and together with the hook exposes her vaginal orifice. He uses the tip of the syringe to bypass the valve fold and injects the semen directly into the median oviduct. There, it's done. Bill removes the now fully unconscious B and marks her for identification. He will place her in a bee cage containing a bit of honey to recover. Then, if she seems healthy, next day he places her in her future hive, but still in her cage. She will also get another CO2 treatment. This promotes egg production. If, after a few days, it appears the hive has accepted her, he will release her from her cage to become the hive's new queen.